Hey y'all, Ashley here. Hope you're doing well. Today I'm coming on with a Christmas in July project share. So this is actually the first year I'm doing any Christmas crafting in July, but um, this is part of a giveaway. So if you're interested in entering in, this is for a giveaway for $10 off of the Scrap Diva website. And all you need to do to enter is like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below, and you will be entered into a raffle um, for, like I said, $10 off the website. So, a uh, fun little giveaway, easy to participate if you're interested. Um, and yeah, so for today, what I'm going to do is share some projects that I made, Christmas projects I made using some of her dies. Um, none of these dies are particularly, like, specifically Christmas themed. Actually, what I'm doing is, um, I took a bunch of her, like, packaging dies and from the site and, um, I kind of made like a whole like, Christmas packaging bundle. Um, and I will actually list all these as well on my shop, in my shop, just as one bundle altogether. Um, but yes, so anyways, the collection I'm using is called Let It Snow. This is a doodle book collection from a while back, um, or like maybe like a year or two ago. And so yeah, let's get into some of the things. So, um, this is the first die. It's called Rainbow Shopping Bag. Um, it comes with this little rainbow piece too. And all you have to do is cut this piece out twice and it makes a little baggie. And this is the little bag I made. This is a little rosette die from my stash to kind of embellish a little bit. I use a little Santa paper here and a little Santa guy up front. So yeah, just a cute little bag. And um, it cuts out the little holes here for your ribbon. And then inside, I just added in a couple of those pops. You know, little um, pops to make like enamel dots on your, on your pages. So yeah, added in a little Christmas theme pop guys in there. <laughs> Um, and that's this first little package. Let's move this. Okay, and then the second one is this 3D tiny vial gift box. Um, and you cut out this like large piece first and then it comes with the little layering pieces for your uh, pattern paper. So I just used some like heavy cardstock for the base and then a little bit of uh, actually a page protector to make the little clear part in the middle and then lined everything up, added a little bow and then added this like little mini clothespin. This is also from Doodlebug, these little clothespins. And then inside I just added in some large beads from that kind of match the color scheme of the collection. So that's this little second little package. And then one of my favorite um, packaging dies actually from a while back. This is called Swap Bag Envelope. And um, this is what it looks like. You get all the layering pieces again. And this is what it makes. So you could get this little envelope, 3D envelope. I added in some charms here, a little mini dangle, and then a little shaker. This is for my stash, a little shaker um, film strip, and then a little snowman guy here, a little cluster. And then this is a little shaker snow globe that I made with a little jutabug pop up at the front. And then here you can see all the like layering pieces as well that come with it like all the stitch layering pieces for this die and then next one it's called 3d gift box and this is what this one makes so this is actually pretty um i think i mentioned this before most of these dies are not that old um, and I've made projects with them before, but just not Christmas projects. Um, 
But yeah, I, last time I think I mentioned like it's pretty, you can actually fit quite a bit into this box. Um, I really like the size of it. So here again, added in a little bit of, um, added in all the layering pieces, added in some of the charms, like look at these little reindeers that I have, so cute. Little reindeers, little acorn pieces, little bows, and then up front I have a little cluster. And then, oops, it's gonna fall out here. Inside, um, it's full of different like tags and journaling pieces and whatnot. So I made a bunch of these shaker tags and these have like a good amount of shaker pieces, shaker bits in here, uh, like sequins and things. Um, and like kind of like this little pastel -y mix and some more of like the doodle bug ephemera and um the little uh like texture stickers that they have i'm forgetting the name for these things now but they're like they, they kind of pop up a little bit um yeah this little <laughs> look at this little yeti guy so funny um and then this one is these guys are more like little journaling inserts with little note card pieces in here um and more animals love some animal ephemera <laughs> so just have some fun little uh, journaling pieces in here so yeah those are all the projects i made um hope you like seeing some of my christmas crafting and this uh this is part of a hop so make sure you check out the next person um i'll leave in the description bar below all the all the ladies who are participating and um yeah thanks for watching i uh, will see you guys on the next one bye